Howdy, JBS8. General Dreger is here once again to talk about the beast mentality. You know, in the last video, I spoke about conflict. Uh, I mentioned that if you're in conflict and you're inwardly minded, often your only perspective on how to resolve the conflict is likely going to have blind spots. And in fact, because we tend to discount the other when we are inward, those blind spots more often than not are right at the crucial areas of a relationship. Now, what I want to do is I want to peel that apart just a moment here in this talk. Uh, we refer to that dynamic where our blind spots are right at crucial areas of the relationship. We refer to that dynamic as collusion. When two people are inwardly minded and in some form of conflict, they'll often fall victim to this really devious dynamic. Now, it's complex and there's a lot of human interaction that goes on there, but the result is very simple. Each person involved in a collusion will only ever act in a way that extends the collusion and often in ways that damage the relationship. Oddly, it's because the very blind spots we have are often the, thing, the very things we need to see in others. Once you take a pause and you consider how you might be party to the conflict, you've taken a step into an outward mindset. Now, when you do that, you can own your own role in the conflict, own your own role in the problem set in front of you, and then make the one change that only you can make. And that's a change in how you act as the party in the conflict. And amazing things can happen, though, when you consider the other person's needs and objectives. Now, just for the naysayers that might be out there, I said consider, not give in to, consider their needs and objectives. And in doing so, you adjust your behaviors in ways that seek true resolution and not in ways that simple, simply further conflict and collusion. So as you think about your relationships with some of the other folks that are out there, uh, you might want to consider your impact on the other folks. And if the things that you're saying and the things that you're doing are inviting the behaviors that, that you're not wanting to have happen. And then maybe you can adjust taking into account their needs and objectives and find a way out of the collusion. So good luck on that effort. Continue to work after getting after that beast mentality, that outward mindset. And until next time, thanks Beast Nation.